Hey everyone, this is Moss Triple One, and we are playing Dragon Guard 2. Now, as you can see, we have some new items available in the Village of Stones weapon shop, but they're pretty much not going to be too great for us. I'll show you what they are here. I think I might buy one new weapon in here. Yeah, we got Glory's Bane as well as Magi Sorrow. I think I'll go ahead and buy this one. Er, no. And, as you can see, we actually do have some new accessories. We got this, raises magic and strength by 10, so you can easily increase your strength. And this here reduces physical damage by 10%. I think we'll go ahead and buy the magic ring here. And that'll probably be it for now. And I'll go ahead and show you how you equip it. So we're going to go into the equipping screen. Because this here is the first bit... <clears throat> first accessory that we got besides old earrings at last. So, to equip an accessory, you just uh, select it and put it in. Since there's only one accessory at a time, that's all you do. And we'll go ahead and go out of this now. So, now that we got that, you'll ask us to save. I don't think so, because all we did was just buy a new accessory. So we'll just go ahead and continue the game, and we will continue... In a brand new place in Chapter 4, Morning Stream. So here we go. See what's going to be going on over here. Okay, who's this? <laughs> That's creepy. Kane, that was the name of the hero who saved the world 18 years ago. So Flynn's key has been destroyed. Destroyed. Four more keys remain. So we're just gonna go ahead and start. Man, I don't know what that little sub event was, but certainly creepy. We've come a long way. A really long way. What's this, my boy? Are you afraid of coming out into the big wide world? You should not fear the unknown. You should embrace it. Legna, does nothing frighten you? Legna, what happened to you? I noticed. My body changes as the environment changes. When the situation becomes grave, I evolve. It is the blood memory of the dragon. As long as that memory is within us, we can stand firm in times of adversity. Adversity? Yes. Times don't get much more adverse than that. Why the long case, my boy? I told you before, regret is for fools. Legna, I'm not as strong as you. I'll never be able to return to the Knights of the Seal now. In just a few seconds, I've gone from night to exiled traitor. Will you stop sitting on my back and whining? <laughs> You'll pull through. I know you will. I'm tired. Let's find a place where we can rest a while. So yeah, and see, even Noah here has noticed that Lightning has changed. Basically, they're going to be some bats, and they're going to be pretty easy, yep. They are no match for Legna now. We can really take them out easy. And now he's gotten a level up. And here's the breath attack. Ooh, we managed to get it. And, uh-oh, here are the Knights of the Seal again. Basically what that says is the knights are been waiting above the village of sand. That's where we were originally going. Oops, I missed. Oh well. Yeah, now that Legla has evolved and gotten some more powerful breath attacks, we can do more damage to these guys. Of course, these ones here are actually, these blimps here are actually weaker than the ones that were over the Grand Shrine. Those ones there were actually some of the toughest ones. Yeah. 
And here are some more planes. Now we gotta try and take out them out. We only, there are basically about three of them, but you only need to take out two. We'll go ahead and try and take out some of these other blimps as well. They're just target practice though. Try and take out these planes. There, that's two. So this there's the only one left and he's gonna run. So now we are going to Noe's old home, the Forgotten Ruins. That's basically where Noe has been ever since before he was found by the Knights of the Seal. But if they found us there before, couldn't they find us again? You don't really need to worry about these gargoyle cubes, you can just fly on. And here are some griffins. Well, at least it's our turf, and we should be able to handle ourselves pretty well over there. Let's see, we got about five new griffins completely surrounded by gargoyle cubes. No need to worry too much. So we just got to try and take out the griffins, since they're the our target, as you can see. These gargoyle cubes are actually a little stronger than what we've been facing before. That's why they're not dying quite so quickly, but they're not still not really all that great, especially EXP-wise. And that's the last of the Griffins. In the end, it seems to be the only place I can fall home. So, now we are going to land and... There's no way they can have followed us here. Yes, I leave with a two trackers down. It won't do them much good. This is our damage. Yep, so now we are back to our old home. Go ahead and go through this and we'll continue on. Which one, which one? I'll continue to save over this one. And I think we will also continue, but first I'm just going to try and change something in the screening here. Yeah, I'm going to try and make this a little brighter. Okay, never mind that. Okay, that's right. I already tried, but I couldn't. Basically, what I was trying to do, I was trying to make the screen brighter, because I noticed that some of the caves that we are in, it's completely impossible to see on the video. So, I thought I could probably try and brighten that up, but I guess I can't. Sorry about that. I probably could have did that off screen, but oh well. A little moment between knowing and like now. Now, as you can see here, the map here is actually pretty big, but we're only going to be covering a little bit of it mission by mission. So, we are going to go ahead and start things off. First, we're going to fly into this little corner because there are some gargoyle cubes here. We'll go ahead and shoot them down. Just to get our <clears throat> magic up so I can show you some of the new overdrive. 
overdrives that we have. So, apparently we need to break down these rocks somehow in order to get through that. How we do that is there are some crystals over here that we need to light up. And there they are. They're pretty high, too high for noise, so we're going to have to get them with Legna. This might be a trap. And I'll go ahead and show you some of the new overdrives we got here. Here's a new one, Fierce Flame. Fierce Fame. Uh, ooh, pretty red. Ooh, gory too. <laughs> and of course we got shamans again. They should be a lot easier now that no Legnet's flames powered up. Okay, will you guys quit shooting me? It really got me already here. There's another crystal right over there that we got. And I'll show you, well, I guess I'll show you the my most powerful overdrive here a little later here. We'll light up this uh, crystal. And I, okay, yep. Well, yeah, just need to light up the crystals like that and you're good. Yeah, of course. Mainly hmm, because it was covered up by rocks, maybe an avalanche or something. Strange how we need to light crystals in order to break it, and there's another one. With some crystals right there. Here's another rock wall. So, I'm just going to go ahead and show you the new Dragon Overdrive right now. We already did Fierce Flames, Merciless Town, same as... Ripper Townsend, here's Infernal Firestorm. Man, now that looks brutal. Yeah, Merciless Town is the same as Ripper Town, so no real reason to show that. Now, with these crystals here, you are time, so you're going to need to take them out quickly. So, you want to start off with one of these far ones here first. Here's it. And then you just got to turn around very quickly and fly like hell. Just give her. Shoot that one quickly. And the last one is just right over in here. So, I'll just go ahead and shoot that, and you've got it. There it goes. My life will go back to the way it was. What purpose? By man? That doesn't sound good. And here are the forgotten ruins where Noah used to live. We finally made it this far. We should be safe enough here. They may still be waiting in ambush. I'm going to investigate. You get off and rest for a while. And so all you need to do is just hit this crystal, open the door, and it's mission complete. The mission board, all we got were a few kills with Legna, and here's the save screen. So I think that'll be it for today, where you got very little time left. So this is Amonis111 saying goodbye, thank you for tuning in, and next time we will be seeing what will be going on in Noe's old home. See ya!